Well, time for some Friday Night Lights, and for the Brainerd Warriors, they couldn't have asked for a better start week one. The come from behind win in dramatic fashion to set the table for 2017, but a tough test here week two. It's the ninth-ranked team in Class 5A. St. Cloud Tech stands on the opposing sidelines, and we're going to second half we go, and it's Nate Trewick finding James Kazor, who gets just two feet in for the score. Tech up big. Brainerd, though, would try to find an offensive groove late in the third quarter. When Joe Stolsky finds Pat Jervinek in the middle of the field for the nice pickup here. That would set this up later in the drive. Stolsky, he's going to keep it himself. He'll gallop in the end zone for the touchdown. But all St. Cloud Tech in this one, they hand the Warriors their first loss of the season, 45-6. to Well, number three in Class 3A appears at home tonight against Holding Ford. Let's start with some defense. Fumble on the snap. Huskies recover, but Reese Kassman is there for a nice tackle for the loss. The next Pioneer possession, it's Luke Gertz from one yard out to put the Pioneers on the board. They would go on to win this one 36-14. They're now 2-0 on the season. To nine-man football we go. Nevis tagged the ninth best team in the state. They host Winnie Mac, and the Tigers didn't take long opening drive. Photographer loses the ball, Colin Selbert. Zach Henry walks into the end zone. 6-0 home team. First Patriot drive, Michael Olsen launches a deep ball, but look at the play by Jack DeWolf for the interception. That would set this up ensuing drive. Kyle Schmidt on the dive for six more. All Nevis in this one, 46-12. They're also 2-0 on the season. To Cass Lake, the Panthers hosting Red Lake, and the home team up big at the half to the second. Jared Brown finds Michael Staples for the pass and catch. He would get into the red zone, then a few plays later, Panthers punch it in. It's the big guy, Sage Humphrey, with the score. Cass Lake being a 52-0, that's their first win in four years. More scores tonight, Bemidji, they lose a tough one, 32-28 on the road. And Grand Rapids, their winners, 27-6. Crookston, they beat Staples Motley 32-7, and Ottertail Central beats Wadena Deer Creek 35-6. Pillager, their 46 winners over Long Prairie Gray Eagle. And then also Bagley, their winners over Black Duck 31 to 7, Royalton 32 to nothing. Rozo falls 56 to 12, and Crosby Ironton falls 34 to 22. Park Rapids, they drop a close one, 7 to 6. Aitken, they're 15 to 6 winners over an international falls. Greenway, they win 18 to 12 over Pine City. Deer River, they fall to East Central 26 to 14. More scores, Kelleher North home, big winner, 60 to 8 over Little Fork, Big Falls. Boston, they would lose 39 to nothing. War Road 34 to 13 over Pine River. Bacchus, Little Falls, they tough lot, tough loss for them over Delano 37 to six. And Walker Hackensack, Akeley, they fall 34 to 13. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.